Well, for now, commuters will have to get around the old-fashioned way. In Norway, some unsuspecting taxi passengers got a huge surprise. The man behind the wheel of the cab turned out to be their prime minister. Sean Mallon has the story. Of all the taxi drivers in Oslo, none has ever drawn such puzzled looks. You look a lot like Stoltenberg, says this rider. Jens Stoltenberg, that is, the Norwegian prime minister. And it was. As prime minister, it is important to listen to people's opinions, he says. And in taxis, people really say what they mean. So in a political reality show filmed in June by his Labour Party, Stoltenberg ditched the business suit, adopted the garb of a cabbie, and got behind the wheel. Some passengers took a bit of time to figure it out. You look like... Maybe it's the eyes, says this woman. Yes, maybe just the eyes, he responds. And then she gets it. Stoltenberg first came to international attention two summers ago during the grim days after the massacre perpetrated by Anders Breivik. Now he faces a tough election campaign, trailing in the polls, many voters feeling that after eight years in power, his party's been in government too long. Time to change the channel. Thus, the cabbie stunt. <laughs> Lucky because I was going to send you a letter anyway, says this one. The conversations ranged from education to oil policy to getting out the vote. So you're driving a taxi part-time, asks this man. Yes, part-time, says the PM. The passengers all got their rides for free, and at least one complained about the quality of the ride. As PM, he hasn't had much practice driving himself lately. Stoltenberg says even if the voters fire him from his current job in the September 9th elections, he will not be taking this up as a new career. Sean Mallon, Global News, London.